Paul Rise Mzanzi says it has a solid plans to rebuild the country's troubled economy. The party says it includes measures like increased crime fighting efforts and getting power utility ESCOM into a good standing. Rise Mzanzi leader Songhezo Zibi, uh, the country says the country's power crisis is man-made by those who are stealing from ESCOM. He's also promised qualifying South Africans free electricity through solar projects. We have to rebuild our economy. We have to fix our economy so that we can make our manifesto a reality. This is going to be very hard, but we have a good plan for fixing our economy and putting people to work. First, we will tackle violent crime. People cannot open or run businesses when they get robbed or killed every day. You cannot keep and run a business when you are afraid. We also cannot get foreign investment if people are afraid to come to our country. So we have to fix crime. Second, we will fix ESCOM so that it can power our economy. The only reason ESCOM is in this situation is because the cadres see it as a cow that they need to milk. They see Transnet the same way. They see municipalities the same way. And if we get them out, we get the best people we can find to be on the board, to be in the management team, to run the power stations. We can fix ESCOM. So we will cancel all of these inflated corrupt contracts and replace them with properly priced clean contracts to save ESCOM money. We will use cheap international funding and grants to produce solar energy products here in South Africa, train South Africans to produce them here and put solar power in every single home.